All right, this is part two of how to download Google Maps and navigation on your Kindle Fire HD. So, um, to get to this website here, uh, what you want to do is scroll down to right below the video in the notes section. There's a link right there that you're going to click on. It's going to take you right to this website. And this is where you're going to download the file you need to get Google Maps installed on your Kindle Fire HD. So, once you click on that link, it takes you here. Go ahead and click on download. Okay. And you're going to see start downloading right here. You're going to pull the menu down right here. Okay. And so it's going to start doing the download for you. This can take anywhere from five seconds up to a couple minutes, depending on how fast your internet connection is. So just be patient with it. And it's actually moving pretty quick, so that's good. It's finished now. So what we're going to do is we're going to go home. And we're going to use an app now that's called File Manager Free. And just to show you what it is, we're going to go to Apps. We're going to go to Store. And here we go. And you're going to type in. You're going to type in File Manager Free. Hit Search. And there's only one app that's called this. So you literally cannot miss it. It's going to be the first one that comes up, File Manager Free. You're going to tap on this and download it. It is a free app. Okay. And this is the app we need to open the file we just uh, downloaded so that we can uh, install it. So after you go ahead and download this, we're going to open that. I'm going to just hit open right here. And this will bring up um, the app. Now, the first thing you're going to see when you open the app is you'll see a lot of these different folders. You want to go down to the one that says Downloads or Download and click on where it says Maps 6.12.0 mod signed.apk. Tap on that and now it's going to say, Do you want to install? Hit install. And now it's going to start installing. Installation takes really no, excuse me, no time at all. It's nice and quick. And we're just about at the end right now. Hit open. And now you officially have Google Maps on your Kindle Fire HD. Press accept. Okay. And we can go ahead and put in, I'm going to put in, put in Best Buy to see what comes up. So let's see. A whole lot of locations come up. So now I'm going to type in Best Buy Culver City. Okay, I think I spelled it wrong, but we'll tap this one Best Buy near Culver City. It's going to search, and we're going to go ahead and tap on this one for directions. And this is the store, hit directions. And now here's the thing, it says driving navigation, but that feature does not work on this Kindle. Okay, so letting you know, this isn't, wasn't necessarily made for the Kindle, so all the features don't work. But um, you can, the best thing to do is to do get directions and it'll um, give you a list of directions that you'll be able to use um, to get there basically. Kind of like what you would get on googlemaps.com um, or what you would get from like MapQuest. So um, it works well. Uh, it just doesn't have, the, the Kindle Fire doesn't have a GPS built in, so even if you have internet connected with the, the tablet, it still won't actually give you turn-by-turn uh, -turn navigation, but it will give you directions. Alright, so this is it. We officially installed um, Google Maps from the Kindle Fire HD. The last thing you want to do is go ahead and pull down your menu, go to More, and go to Device, and go to Allow installation of, of applications from unknown sources and you want to turn that off because that basically keeps your Kindle protected from any type of um, viruses or anything uh, that's not supposed to be in there being in there. Alright, so hope you found this helpful. If you did, like the video. Uh, make sure you subscribe to H2 Tech videos and keep watching. We appreciate your views. Alright, have a good one.